See this? I'm like a freaking tack. I knew it. I'm like a tack. Sharp one. Real sharp tack. I'm like a, I'm like a really sharp tack. Hold on. I don't know if I mentioned, but I'm like a really sharp tack. <laughs> <laughs> we got it, Grenade. We found it. I don't know if I can hook this turn in here like that. These guys are trained professionals. And me, I'm just a, oh. I'm going this way. Yeah. It's okay. There's people here. Oh, there's a couple people, yeah. Yeah, it's quite a few steps up, but uh, yeah, it should be fun. Grandfather, granddaddy, Hi, Bob. Granddaddy. Hey, buddy, you got one. That's awesome. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I need a rail, and I'm in business. Thank yeah, you. he does pretty Thank good you, with that buddy. rail. Thank my you, sir. Twins just passed. Oh. Yeah, this is Who's that? My mom up top. Oh, man. Yeah, they're Catholic. She just passed. And it's like, uh, I washed my dad. I saw him pass, but she is. This is one of yeah. Like taking her own mom. Yeah. You get yeah. Yeah, it's uh You alright, Daryl? Yeah. Yeah, it's rough. Hey, it's just steps to heaven. We come up here. Yeah. What's that been? Has it been a year or two maybe? Oh, it's been about a long too. Yeah. Where's How long? Huh? We're from Louisville. Louisville? Yeah. How long's it been since we was it a year or two? It's been two, I think. I think it's been two years. Yeah, two. That's the way we're up here. Yeah, and yeah. They're fixing it up pretty good, though. And then I uh, mind trying to yeah, get some charity for this. Yeah, first came up here in uh, 2003. Like 2003. Yeah. Oh, yeah, my dad passed 2006. I think we come in 2008 up here. And yeah. uh, she passed away a few months after we made it up here. And so. Uh, wow. Sort of. What's that? Feel like a. Want to come up here every now and then, just to get close to God. Yeah. That's yep. what it is. That's exactly what it is. That's what Mom is. She, we come up here. She said, "You want to go up here to Dennis?" Yeah. I think they need to do a little repair work. Yeah, get that's what I was just and, saying. And yeah. Repair I'm gonna work. see. I know some lot of people that are like that. He's wearing uh, UK now. He's Ninety-two years old. Yesterday. Yesterday. Yeah. I got wearing that one. Yeah. We need to take a break right here. You're wearing me out. Yeah. He does pretty well, really. I mean, that's I mean, a that's here. a heck of a climb there. Yeah. It it is a good one. This is my mom, Sandy. I'm Hi seventy. This yeah. Is Rob. Rob, yeah. Right. Rob, yes, sir. Rob. Yep. This is Granddad. Yep. I was telling him we make YouTube videos together. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, we just, well, we uh, tell them where we've been, good daddy. I'll make one now. Yeah, we are. Well, yeah. Today? Not today. <laughs> oh. <laughs> In the past, where have we been? Oh, great. We've been as far as California, uh, all the states in between, and, uh, oh, and then the other way, we went to uh, Virginia, West Virginia, up that way. Yeah. Down into North Carolina. 
You, yeah, see, you got a real pretty uh, sight right there, didn't you? Yeah, yeah. oh yeah. The last uh, two or three That's years, we've done quite right a there. bit of traveling. Well, we're from uh, Colorado originally, but we've been here since 1979. You could be a skier. Where in Colorado? Glenwood Springs. Yeah, I know all about it. Right in the I Rockies, Aspen. Oh, yeah. I love it, man. Yeah, so I've been through there quite a few times. Right. It is and in fact, thing. since you guys are from Colorado, that's where we, the first time we went out there, I took them to... Uh, uh, she wants to move to Grand Junction. But well, go ahead. Grand Junction's a cool. It's cool. Yeah. But it's a I little like too far. Me. It's a little too far out for me. Really? Um, I'd rather... You made it. Huh? You made it. Yeah. Oh, I wasn't, didn't have any doubts about making it. I didn't have any doubts either. So, here, you want to explain what's going on here? What, where we are, you know, what happened? What? Well, I. How do we even know about this? I don't even know. This is a religious shrine, but uh, for, for the life of me, I, I don't recall the name of it. Well, I'm not real sure either. Uh, I first came up here with uh, with my daughter, Susan, and uh, I've come back every year or two since. That was in, uh, the first time we came up was 2003, and I've been coming back each, uh, every year or two since. It had changed. Huh. They need to do a little repair on the steps coming up. Yep. The, some of the banisters have uh, given away, rotted and fallen by the wayside. Other than that, everything is pretty much. It is pretty much the same. Boy, yeah. that's dangerous over there, Grenade. Those rocks are slick. Be careful about these rocks. Okay. You could have a seat if you want, I guess, maybe. <laughs> that thing doesn't fall over. <laughs> Here we go, you guys. Um, so let me tell you on what I, what I know about this. My mom found this spot. There was something in the paper about this particular spot and people would come up here and they would see things. Um, they would either see um, shadows, or you know, uh, uh, you know, godly things. They would see. Um, I don't remember particularly right offhand, but my mom saw this in the newspaper, and she wanted to come up here. This was months before she died maybe she died May 6th so I would say that this was March yeah probably around March um, she yeah she wanted to come up so my grandfather brought her up here and uh, that back then he was driving and everything was you know everything was good and uh, I'm sure, much like me bringing him up here, it was probably a struggle for her to, get, to make it up those steps. Um, I was not here. Sometime after Mom passed, he asked me to bring him out here, and, and uh, I've been out here once. Um, feels good peaceful very peaceful that's about it that's what I know and uh, that's what I got so. Life is not really defined by how much money you make. You're much richer if you have people to care about.
and they care about you. Can't buy that. That comes with time and effort. Appreciate the people that are right there with you. They need it. It would have been a cross over there to the right. You got anything monumental to say? <laughs> Being monumental. Getting up here is monumental <laughs> for me. <laughs> That's about perfect. <laughs> well, I tell you, compared to to uh, me, your mom when she came up, I can't believe she made it. But uh, she did all the way up here, and she stayed up here for. Uh, oh, great. I'd say a half hour. And, Damn uh, rocks are slick. Step over that one. Get down here to this up right here. You can. Yeah, I'll that, just get that here and hold on. This is dry, Grenade. Why don't you get up here and sit? Is that dry? Yeah, yeah. <coughs> and I have to knew about this place. I have no idea. I do know. Do you? Yeah, I remember. She found it in the paper. She bugged me to take her out here. And honestly, you know, as a young kid, I didn't... Uh, you know, I was naive. Well, the pickup truck, we just I just bought a, probably a month before or less. Okay, yeah. And uh, The Red this, Ranger. Yeah, and this is the first trip we made in it. Yeah. Uh, to come out here. I know that truck's always had a lot of sentimental value to you. Oh, yeah. 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 On the way back, I remember we stopped a place on the right, somewhere from here to, to Bartstown, and it was like a Long John Silver's, and we had, uh, Susie had fish. Well, I did too. We both had fish. Yeah. Huh. But she made it up here. I didn't think she would, but, but she sure did. Yeah, that's pretty good. That's a heck of a haul of those, those, you know, those well, steps. Well, for you it isn't, but... Uh, what? I feel it too. If I'm feeling it, I know you're feeling it. That's how yeah. I know that it's a haul. I mean, it's not... It's not a walk in the park but for if me. But you, if you try to walk it all by, you you know, in one, one go-round without stopping, I mean, you're sort of winded get when you get up here. Right. How you doing over there? Hmm? <laughs> I said, how you doing? doing great. It looks like it. Looks like you're doing pretty good. Yeah, they got those built up all along the way. Yeah. I don't know where we are, but... We're there. Huh? You don't know where we are, but we're there. <laughs> That's right. Here it says, settled by George and Elizabeth Grundy in 1780 after fleeing a war-torn Berkeley College, Virginia. Berkeley CO, I don't know what that is. Virginia, 
this wilderness frontier of VA, Virginia, then called Kane, Tucky, became a state in 1792. Son Samuel stayed on the farm and expanded it. Another son, Felix, chose law and politi politics. This portion of the farm still remains in the Grundy family. Since huh. 1780, Granddaddy. Yeah. Look at what a beautiful piece of property. This used to be Virginia. This is Virginia. We were in Virginia right now years ago in 1780. Look at that beautiful house. Oh, yeah. Oh, my Lord. Look I, at I'd love to go through that thing. That is awesome. Yeah. Look at the wall. I bet that wall, they... I wonder how old that damn thing is. Well, I would think that it, that, I mean... That might be too... Yeah. Love adventure! They got barns that just, they just stick them out and see I mean, look how beautiful that is. Wow. And all of this on the right. And somebody cleared all that off. Yeah. That must have taken an enormous amount of time. Yeah. This is beautiful, Granddad. I love it. It's exactly what I wanted. I don't know where where we are, but I feel like we're here. You'd like to own about 50 acres out here? 50? About well, 3,000. Well, you'd like to own 1,500, but... Yeah, 3,000 maybe. <laughs> what just an awesome piece of property. Look at this beautiful creek right here. Yeah. I don't know what it is. Nice sandstone. It looks like the old road maybe went through there. I don't know what's about to happen here. I wonder if this is probably still their property. Just awesome. Uh, we need a gas station, Granddaddy. Where's the gas station? Back where we came? <laughs> yeah, well, unless we're going towards Bloomfield. I'm not sure. We need a... I mean, we got a little. I got about 60 miles. 50 miles. <laughs> 